Well, this first reported by the Times Union, Naman Hussein, the owner of the limo company involved in the 2018 mm -hmm. Scahari limo crash, is now asking to be released on bail pending appeal. Our Skylar Eagle joins us now with what we know so far about the case here. Skylar, good morning. Ryan, Christina, good morning. Nauman Hussein was sentenced in May after he was convicted of 20 counts of manslaughter in the deadly 2018 Schoharie limo crash. Hussein is currently serving a 5 to 15 year sentence in prison for that conviction. Now his lawyer, Lee Kinlan, confirms to News 10 they're asking for Hussein to be released on bail while they appeal that verdict. During the trial, Hussein's attorney, Lee Kinlan, argued the blame for the deaths of 20 people in this accident should be put on Mavis discount tire and the mechanics who testified in court. They falsified inspection records and did not make necessary repairs. Schoharie County District Attorney Susan Mallory and Special Prosecuting Attorney Fred Wrench argued Hussein showed a reckless disregard for regulations relating to commercial vehicles and that the loss in this accident could have been avoided. Applying for bail pending appeal is something Kinlan has been working on since the verdict was decided by the jury just three months ago. This is what he told reporters on the day Hussein was convicted. I respectfully disagree with the court's rulings on the uh, instructions they read to the jury. Uh, I disagree uh, with the judge's decision not to dismiss the case. Hussein's appeal for bail will be heard in the New York State Supreme Court on Friday in front of Justice John Egan. We are working to find out more information. We'll have the latest for you on air and online. For now in studio, Skyler Eagle News 10, ABC. Thank you, Skyler.